hello guys and welcome to the channel so today we're going to be doing the bl manual called x wants me love him again so this is going to be chapter 4 and chapter 5 so let's get started with the video please do not forget to subscribe to the channel and leave a like as it really really helps push the videos okay so we see the chapter starts and it's the next morning so you see him sleeping hmm so it seems like he's I don't know sick because we see um, papers used papers in the dustbin It turns out it has been too long since I last vented. So he wakes up. Actually, I thought about forcing myself onto Lumian. Oh, that's that's weird. Nah, that's strange. And it happened several times. Hmm. Ah, this is so embarrassing. Yeah, it is. It's not normal to do that or to think about that. Young Master, Mr. King, and Secretary Zhu. Are waiting for you downstairs for breakfast so someone tells this to him from outside of his door got it I'll come down after changing clothes so you see him is clearly trying to change his clothes So you see him staring at him. So they don't really say words to each other, like there's not much to dialogue, it's just stares. He's like, baby, did you miss me last night? <laughs> did he really he clearly isn't interested in speaking. It seems like you took good care of young master last night. So this is his dad speaking. What's it got to do with you? So he responds to his dad like, what's your problem? As he grabs him. Doesn't concern me. Xiao Zhu probably doesn't think so. So I think he's like mad. Later, I'll have the assistant transfer money to you as compensation for serving Heiju part time. And it's like, so Xiao Zhu is like. Thank you, Mr. Kin. So his dad walks away and he angrily looks at his dad. Are you that desperate for money? How much can he give you? I'll double it for you. 
So he says this as he hugs him. I think he's like jealous. I am indeed in desperate need of money to network. But does he really think I can do anything for money just because of him? If it weren't for him being the one, I would have left long ago. I want a lot. Are you sure you're richer than him? So he's telling him he wants a lot of money. So he doesn't really respond. I'm sorry, young master, King. I have to go to work. So he abruptly like rushes. Guess he doesn't want to be with him for long. I may not have King Yu's wealth right now, but I have a body like you. Ooh. <laughs> okay. So he thinks that to himself. I don't believe that no matter how many times I try, you can really resist. So he's, he's thinking this and he has like this grin on his face. So let's get to chapter 6. To chapter 5, sorry. So we can see this is chapter 6. It's the night. And we see a house and just light in the house. I'm tired today. I attended the banquet with King Yu and interacted with many wealthy and influential individuals. But I didn't find any clues useful for the investigation. So he's investing, investigating, sorry. So he's resting his head against a door. When will I be able to uncover the truth behind my parents' car accident? Oh, so he's investigating his parents' accident. That's sad. So he goes, he gets, he gets a flashback and you see the car burning. They see him trying to like escape. Xiao Mian, hurry up and leave the country with your study abroad. Passport. So you see him crying because he's like leaving his parents in the car. No, I don't want to. This wasn't an accident. Those people are driven by greed. Listen, the only way to survive is to live. And only then we will have a chance to seek revenge. So you see him like, he finally lets go of his dad's hand. And then we're taken back to the present. The people who killed my parents are in the upper circles and King Yu is a key figure. So that's why he's trying to get close to King Yu.
Until I solve that matter, I can only leave as Kinyu's secretary. It seems I'll have to endure this kind of life for a long time. Cheer up and take a shower and get a good night's sleep. So you see him going to do what he just does about, you know, take a shower and go to bed. So you see him undressing. He's got apps. So of course he goes to the shower and he's taking a shower. He's blurred of course. Hey baby, I want want to take a shower together. <laughs> so like the dude just appears from nowhere. That's crazy. What are you doing here? What do you want? I want to offer you some special services. <laughs> okay. Seems like he undressed himself. You see that, like he's clearly not interested. Hey, don't go. So he's walking away. So he grabs him by the arm. Do you really not have any feelings for me? I think he does have feelings. He obviously has feelings for him. No. I think he does. What about this? Still no feelings. So we can like imagine what they're doing. Fortunately, I'm too tired today to respond. I don't want to engage in a relationship like this. I have no intentions, but if young Master King insists, I can't resist. I have patience, my dear. Take it slow. So I think he leaves him in the shower and goes to take a phone call. Hey, Xiao Wang, do you know what Zhu Mian and Qin Yu did today? So the person on the phone is like, it seems that Secretary Zhu accompanied President King to attend a banquet function. He got so tired from just attending a banquet function. It seems I need to quit my job as a driving instructor and accompany him at the King Group. So I think this is the next day. The next afternoon. King Yu is such a good actor. He clearly wanted me to work at the company in the morning. 
but wasted the whole morning on some on some useless paperwork. So you see him rush into the office. Watch your step. So he turns to see and is confused. What's wrong with him? Secretary Zhu had a morning function with clans and had too much to drink. You go and handle your tasks. I'll take care of him. Where's the lounge? So he points him, he directs him to where the lounge is. Over there, at the end. So we see him taking him to the lounge and of course he's clearly drunk. So they stumble, I guess. On the chair, so you see them falling towards the chair. Hey Ju. What's wrong baby? Feeling nauseous. I think they're going to get intimate here, but let's just keep watching. No, I don't want to throw up. I'm just tired. I want you to help me. Give me a hug. So guys, this is where the chapter ends. Hope you guys liked the little recap. I did of the BL manual called X wants me to love him again. If you did, please leave a like. Do not forget to subscribe to the channel and comment down on what type of BL manuals you'd like me to do recaps of. Thank you so much for watching and have an amazing day. Bye.